Dun, 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 dun. Oh my god. Dun, dun, dun. I have a big announcement. Oh, yes, I do. Vina V. I thought this day would never happen. And it's finally happened, guys. Thank you so much for being on this YouTube journey with me. And it's true. <laughs> I have finally got married to my YouTube channel. Oh, that was proper clickbait, wasn't it? I have finally made the decision to commit to a schedule on YouTube. At the beginning of 2020, look, and this video is gonna help you as well on a serious note. I hope you're not too upset, or maybe you don't care if I will ever get married in my life. Um, but we've got to be consistent on YouTube, and you already know that, so why aren't you doing it? I already know that, so why have I not been consistent on this channel for the last four years or however long I've been on here? And it's because life gets in the way sometimes and if you don't plan, if you don't put this like a strategy in place for your YouTube channel, you're going to end up like me. <laughs> you're going to end up like me where you start a YouTube channel and you're just so inconsistent now thank the Lord and thank the universe that I have managed to get over 11,000 subscribers by being highly inconsistent. And when I mean highly inconsistent, I mean to the extent of uploading one YouTube video in like 2019 and not uploading another video in 2019 until like six months later. But even though I've had massive breaks from YouTube, my channel is still getting subscribers and it's still getting views on a daily basis. And that is because I do a lot of videos that are searchable content. And we've talked about this so much on this YouTube channel. But I do a lot of videos and it's my plan for this year to do even more of them is these videos that people are searching for look nobody's gonna take this video as an example i've probably called it something like my big announcement shock horror or something like that now that's mainly for for you my lovely subscriber which is you who you know will probably click on most of my videos if they come up it's another story if you watch it right to the end <laughs> but at least you click on the video this video is not going to be found in search because nobody is searching for my big announcement however if i called this video something like um how to get to 10,000 YouTube subscribers, that is what you call a searchable video because people are searching for how to get more subscribers on YouTube, how to get their first 1,000 subscribers, okay? So that's the first thing you need to think about if you have not thought about this on your own channel yet. What kind of searchable videos can you do? What are people searching for on YouTube that is related to you and related to your niche, all right? Hello, by the way, my name is Vina V and I shift your beliefs and build up your business using the power of YouTube. Have you noticed? I've got a different microphone. This is such a sad day <laughs> because I've always used a lapel mic. A lapel mic is one that you plug directly into your camera or to your phone and you clip it on. And my favourite microphone that has been with me for so long on YouTube, it's, it's just not working. So I'm now using this. This is a Rode Video Mic Pro. Now, usually YouTubers will have this placed on top of their camera. Um, so it'll probably be where you are. So I'll put it all the way here, yeah? And then it's facing me, and so we can get the sound that way. But I'm so used to having um, that lapel, um, really sexy and bassy sound from a lapel mic. I just love the crispness of a lapel microphone because it's just so much more closer to your mouth. So you can hear me like this and we can whisper together. Um, so yeah, this is why I've put the this Rode mic on a cable. I don't know, is this distracting? Let me know in the comments below 
if it's distracting for me to hold this mic because if it is i will um <laughs> i will sadly put it all the way over there um but that's fine if you're using this microphone with it over there it's just this is one of my you know pet hates because i just like having the bassy sexy uh, sound of a microphone when it's closer to your mouth i may at some point have the microphone down here anyway we can do a whole nother video on that if you want me to do a video about my youtube setup please do let me know or maybe you want me to go through my journey of microphones it's like a love story um, I can uh, let you know that as well anyway let's get back to the point of this video and it's about me and you committing to our YouTube channels this is my big announcement that I am now finally committing to my YouTube channel I have been I have pat on the back for me I have been consistent on this channel um, for the last few weeks now and <laughs> that's not happened for years but now I just want to push myself even further and um, this is what my 2020 is all about it's all about doing things differently because if you keep doing the same things you're going to keep getting the same results okay so from now on you are going to get a video from me two times a week the only thing i haven't decided yet is the days of that okay so so don't listen to her ignore what she's saying we are gonna upload every wednesday and saturday at 7 p.m gmt so make sure you put it in your diary uh, or, or just subscribe to this channel and then you'll get notified every wednesday and saturday at 7 p.m gmt when i upload a brand new video to help you build and launch and grow your YouTube channel. We've gotta be committed to our YouTube channels. Learn from my mistakes, learn from my inconsistency. If you want to grow faster, if you want to see more impact, if you want to see more traction from your YouTube channel, then come along with me on this journey of where we're gonna fully commit. I, you know, maybe have treated this YouTube channel like a bit of a, um, I, I, uh, what can we um <laughs> what can we use as an analogy a a guy that i'm not that serious about maybe um but now i am committing to this youtube channel like it is my husband all right <laughs> like it is we've got to commit okay you've got to commit and only you can make that decision is now the right time for you to finally commit to your YouTube channel, for you to finally invest in yourself, for you to learn everything there is about making better videos, making better content, being a better presenter on camera as well, finding different ways to grow your channel, new ways. Have you still not interviewed someone in your channel? Try it, go out and interview people and see what that does for your channel. See what it does for your own skills of how you interview people. You're also serving your audience when you interview people and bring people on here as well. So look, there's so much that we can talk about and we will talk about this um, in the forthcoming videos, okay? But I, yeah, I just wanted to let you know that I'm committing. I want you to commit as well. And you've got to treat YouTube like a business. It doesn't mean you've got to be all serious and be like, oh, let's dress up now in our suits. Just treat it like a business. Have a plan in place. Have a strategy. But then what I also firmly believe is having things that you just do spur. This video was a spur of the moment thing. I just thought, I just want to make a video. Today's a Saturday. My son isn't with me. He's uh, gone to his dad's and I thought, I'm in the mood for making some YouTube videos. So do things off the cuff. Do things when you don't even have a plan. I think, yes, I know it's great to have a plan and have a strategy, but sometimes the most magical things happen when you really do things from your heart, when you don't even have a plan, when you're not always thinking, Okay, if I make this YouTube video, like, what is the outcome? What is the outcome of this? For, for to be honest, my outcome of this video is just, I just want this video to help you. And I'm using this to be consistent <laughs> on my channel as well. I wanted to do a different type of video and try out, you know, my new equipment as well. So you don't always necessarily 
need a solid outcome for every single video. Yes, the majority of them, you do want an outcome. You do want a call to action at the end. And I'm going to do my call to action right now, because if you want to be in, truly investing in yourself from now on, go and check out my free training. Okay. I've put together this YouTube masterclass for you. You can pick a time and a date or when you want to come and join me. And we are going to go through my bulletproof free step formula of how I even got here to 10,000 YouTube subscribers by being inconsistent and, <laughs> and without the need for this endless content creation cycle, because that can start demotivating people when you're just constantly churning. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Does that hurt your ears? Ah. Um, when you're constantly churning and churning and churning out content, that can be damaging for you as well. So book your slot in with me. Let's uh, go through this YouTube training together. The link should be on the screen right now and I'll link it below in the comment as well. Just go to 10kyourway.com and um, yeah, go and check out that free training because it's really going to help you to shift your beliefs and start building up your uh, business on YouTube as well. Previous videos will be on the screen right now. So go and check those out and I will see you in a couple of days with a brand new upload.